You know, Renounce Lock is one of the greatest decks in Hearthstone. But there is one other deck that can rival it. And that is the Thief Rogue, with its incredible randomness potential. Thief Rogue always guaranteed incredibly fun games, well except when playing against another rogue. Anyways, with the next expansion, Thief Rogue is losing Swash Burglar and Undercity Huckster in Standard, two of its core cards, and that was a very very sad prospect, until some of the new Witchwood cards were revealed. Let's start with the incredible addition of Blink Fox. It is like a Swash Burglar, but with the potential to affect the board. 3-3 is nothing special, but it is also not bad. This is a type of non-wombo combo card, that Thief Rogue needs so it can be even remotely viable. Non-wombo combo cards are all nice and good, but what about those with some extra spiciness? Well just take a look at Pickpocket. For 2 mana. It may be worse than the Huckster. But the longer the game goes, the better this card becomes. With the addition of Echo, you could get up to 5 cards in one turn. Now that is some real burgle value. And speaking of Echo, what about the new Rogue Legendary? You may need to grab a cup of water for this one, because it is incredible. Face Collector has Echo, adds a Legendary to your hand, and gosh darn it, it costs 3 mana. This may not be exactly a Thief card, but nevertheless it is an incredible fun card. What an addition to the Rogue, simply amazing. Yet there is one more surprise. One more legendary that will make all Thief Rogue players, all 5 of them, jump in excitement. Tess Grey main everybody, the Thief Yog Saren, the card that seems to play not only spells, but also minions. You want randomness? Play Thief Rogue. You want beyond random randomness? Play Thief Rogue with Tess Grey main. Well that is all for today, the Thief Rogue archetype seems to not be forgotten. In fact, it may be better supported than ever. Maybe it can reach rank 10? See you next time.